Oh, you. So she's on and off. People react to it on and off. Really? Right, there is actually something missing from my toolbox. Where's the flat pole? Flat pole, flat pole. So, Lee Pulling's a bit of a. So, she's absolutely fine walking along the street. Yep. Anywhere new, she's not. Not. I'll be honest with you, normally I'll just walk one of hands, but because it's extra exciting, she's got on the okay. to keep her under a bit more control. So, originally, we had a session with about Aaron when she was six months. Uh huh. Because we could do this now. Um, and we did use a pond for a while, yep. and then she was fine walking on a harness. And yeah, and then she started being people reactive. And now I'm kind of, I don't know what the best tool okay. is to use with her. And oh, okay. she's not overly interested in toys. She's not overly interested in toys. Food? Food, yeah, yeah. Yeah, any allergies? No. What's her name? Jazz. Jazz. <laughs> so she's absolutely fine. People don't look at her. Jazz. Her. If anyone walks out of the zoo, they're going to yep. say hello. She's started barking. And... So instead of a flat pole, push. Yeah, she'll do the flat pole in the garden, but when there's yeah. anything exciting But happening, the reality is, I can get a dog to run in more ways than one. Yeah. Yeah? <laughs> look, look how switched on she is. Right, so if, how many dingo collars do you have? Uh, um, yeah, she'll have one from my back, that side. Yeah. I, I did try a horse, but she won't let me put it on her. She'll bark. No, that's so fine. Mental at me. What I want to do is probably a similar setup to what we've got going over there. Mm -hmm. yeah, yeah. You're not having it. Right, no, it's all right. Sophie's gone to get one, another one. You don't need to be there. What? Oh. What? Oh. Yeah. And she's very much like some people, she'll look like she wants to say hello to. Yep. Someone will say hello and then she'll have a go at them after <laughs> she's gone up to. Sorry, Jim. Yeah, yeah, she <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, so what, what's happening is we're having a conflict of interest right now. Mm -hmm. So the backflip harness says pull like a fucking freight train. The yeah, normal yeah. collar says stop pulling. Yeah, I don't, <laughs> usually it's just pull like a freight train on harness. Yeah. She, she don't, generally doesn't, yeah. as long as it's not too exciting. <laughs> yeah, she's going to mock it. That's all right. But see how I deal with it. I'm just not it's giving it normal. any in, in, interest. Yeah, I'm just just calm. Yeah. Yeah. She's a good dog. I'm just waiting for Sophie to come back with it. Then what I want to do is try her on the front clip and a dingo. Yeah. So we've got a little bit more control going on, right? But then I still wanted to learn she can have fun. And we're going to do some exercises that can help. Because right now, see the heavy breathing? Yeah. And look, she's all over the place, so she's very difficult. So she doesn't, so sometimes she'll just jump up like that. Yeah. Other times she's But look, not I've got no control No, no, this no, that's my problem. Right. <laughs> yeah, Can you just pop that over right. your dog's head? At this stage, I don't really care which way it goes, but she's an absolute nutter. She doesn't normally jump up, but she's obviously yeah. This is it. She hates everything going on. Yeah, that, that she doesn't like the harness. Thing. She doesn't like the horty. She doesn't like yeah. anything. Right, do that up nice and tight, right at the top of her head. Yeah, there we go. Just give me one lead attached to it. What anyone right now doesn't matter. Yep. Come on, nutty girl. Can we just now take the one off her collar and yeah. stick it on her bunny? <laughs> so by rights, she should understand the concept of pressure release if she has had a phone collar. Yeah. She's not known with this man. 
Hold on. Yeah. I need to get some. Yeah. What did I do with all my chairs? Oh, I actually unloaded them all in here, didn't I? Right. You say she's clickers range, yeah? Well, she's pretty good at it until there's something really exciting and then she's not. <laughs> all right. One click or two? So what I'm doing is every time she does something with her light, she's in the correct position, I'm just rewarded. Oh, we need lots more. I might have to go and get another bag. Hello. Hello. All right, so you say she can be reactive. Yeah, so she, she'll walk down the high street, people around her um, climb because there's so many people, I think she can't focus. But if someone was to walk straight up to her, so it would stop jumping up. Um, well, she'll either jump up at them or she'll bark yeah. at them, basically go away. She doesn't like it at all. So what I'm doing is when she sits, instead of jumping, yeah. I'm just clicking and rewarding. Yeah. Right, so, do you want to walk towards me a little bit? So look, I know she's going to struggle, stop there, see that? She's telling me she's going to jump, right? She, I know she's going to jump, yeah. right? So, keep walking. So I can just keep her attention on me a little bit. Come here, come here. Good. A little bit closer. See, look, she's getting That's, ready. Yeah. Comes back up, reward. So I have to be the one to say, look, that's as far as you can go. That's as far as you can go. She's not ready to be touched because she's like that coiled spring. Yes, yeah, she, she can't handle it. But already, just the notion of, hello, just the notion of having her on the harness and front collar Makes it easier. Yeah. So we're going to come round. So, start coming towards me. Keep coming, it's fine. Good, so it's right there, looking. So it's right there. Well, did you see how she looked at Soph then and I clicked? Yeah. But she knows what that clicker means. Watch this. This is how I can stop her jumping up. So as Sophie comes in, she's going to look at Sophie like that. But here's that. Yeah. Look at Sophie didn't jump. I can reward that. Right? Come around, come around, come around. Sit. So I'm rewarding a series of behaviours for the dog. Yeah. But I'm keeping that focus with me. Walk straight past me, Sophie. Come on in. And look, there we go. Yeah? Yeah. She's heavily food right, mate. She loves these treats, by the way. <laughs> All right, so can you go and get me a bag of those treats? I have got them, but I had to empty them out. Because she usually has just kibble. She's loving it. Oh. What? Oh, no. well, the only ones we got in stock in the strop. In the... So, she, because she weren't looking at her, she's kind of thinking she's all right. Probably okay, well, is when someone goes, let's, let's can do you, that. Yeah. Can you, yeah, basically, I'm going to say hello to right. the dog, and I say, no, ignore her. They ignore me. Yeah. And... <laughs> That's when a pet corrector comes into play, and you spray them in the phone. <laughs> yeah. So, the problem is, Just... I can show you what to do, right? So, yeah. we're going to do that in a second. Okay. I'm just going to basically keep your dog occupied. I'm going to wait for Sophie to come back, and then I want some male volunteers. Anybody want to volunteer? Yep, perfect. Not just yet, I'll get you up in a second. Okay. Without one, I think hats might be a thing as well. 
just from who she's reacted to. Where's Ev? <laughs> trying to like... Ev? Marco? Can you get the funky hat? <laughs> ben bought one for a reason. Never didn't know what reason, but well, we do. I just liked them, all right? I just yeah. liked them. Yeah, I know, but they're now going to be game changing. Well, it should probably be good as gold. <laughs> well, hopefully. Oh, fish, well, the fish ones are the ones I was using. Oh, fish. What are they? They are Anko. Anko. Right, there's fish bites. Where are you from? Uh, Cambridge Way. Okay, well, there's a shop down there that sells them. Okay, uh, I mean, most pet shops these days are coming more around to the idea of raw feeding and things like that. So you're getting a lot more natural foods and stuff in there. You like these. Uh, right. I've used Soph. I might have to use Ben. Okay. Ben might have to put the silly hat on, or you might have to put Leo away and put the silly hat on. No, oh, well, we need, we need men. Which one? Yeah, go for that one. Well, no one would be able to see me if I had the camouflage one. <laughs> this is true. True that. Oh, actually. <laughs> <laughs> With the umbrellas. And we they say we don't go above and beyond. I can never get it mine in a hole. That's what she said. That, really? That's what she said. <laughs> well, <I'm numbered. laughs> right. So, dog under control. Get that rewarded. Should I have it like that? Yeah, fairly short sure because the reality is you don't want leverage. So Ben is going to walk over, right? Now, the reality is your dog does have a threshold. I'll take that, right? Where's my phone, bro? So stay where you are. Where's it going? Oh, I hate all those. Right, so Ben, start walking over, right? See there, stop there. You see, that's your dog's threshold. As soon yeah. as it starts going wiggle bum, yep. springboard, yep. you need to be getting your reward in there. So Ben, walk okay. away. Okay. Right, so look, as soon as she starts going wiggle bum, springboard, yep. click. Okay. Right, go on, Ben. Click. I think she likes my clicker more. Yeah, I think she does. My well, clicker does this. Yeah. Look, straight away. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah darling. Like times like this you wonder where you got here in life <laughs> well done ben right, right. now ben is going to be a complete dickhead right right your worst nightmare yeah it is he's going to reach straight <laughs> in he's going to try and touch your dog right but as soon as your dog acknowledges Ben coming you're going to click and you're going to move backwards and you're going to hold your dog's attention with a tree right Ready? Oh wow, your dog's lovely. Click, Come on, click. Click. Back, 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 back. Move, 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 move. move. That's it. That's what you do. If you don't want to say no, if you don't yeah. want to punch someone in the face, if you don't want to kick them in the junk, yeah. right? And you're not that way inclined to say back the fuck off. Yeah. Do that. Okay. The reality is most people go, oh, what a beautiful job. Can I say hello? Yeah. Yeah. And you just keep a little bit of focus on yeah. you. Yeah. Not everyone's going to reach in. Unfortunately, some people do. They don't ask and think they're entitled to touch everyone's dog. In that case, move backwards. So stay there. Better approach like a normal person. If she stays there, look, she's gonna look, click, reward. You don't always have to move back. It's only okay, somebody so. reaches in to touch. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. And the other thing you can do to help her out as well. Yeah. So you're giving her one bit. If you want her to stay with you a little bit closer, Sorry. right? Ben walks walls. See that? Yeah. You don't have to worry. And you can do that anywhere. You can have someone walking towards you. Oh, hello. Just move backwards. Just keeping the dog's focus on you. Yeah. Everything like that. Yeah. So let's just get you a little bit sorted out with this. Right. Get, get a finger clicker. I've just ordered a finger clicker. Thank you. And is that nervousness her wagging rather than excitement? Because she does that and I think oh, she's happy and then she's... It depends where her tail is. She's very, very submissive, saying hello to people. Well, half, half the problem we have is she's got an incredibly long leg. Yes. Yes. Oh, come on. It's nice and smooth. Everything's nice and smooth. 
Yeah. Yeah. She's not a bad dog at all. She walks quite nicely on the slip. We can go here. I think you're very nervy. I am. Yeah. I'm because as soon as look, look how well worse. she walks when I have to leave. Yeah. As soon as you have to leave, you kind of just get a little bit kerfuffle. Yeah. I because she started reacting to people, I got more nervous, which makes more um, nervous. So just, yeah. <laughs> but she's so biddable and easy to work with. Okay. Right. So does anybody know where the red fox bit of the lab comes from? And why this is so much smaller than your typical lab? What? She's a lab. She's a red fox Labrador retriever, 15 months old. Does anyone know why she's so bloody small? What? Well done, Soph. Yeah. <laughs> she's got working lines in her. So you have what we call show lines and working lines, yes? Show lines are what you'd see. Looks like a nice scarf on a show line. Yeah, beautiful specimen of a tree, in a sense. Working lines aren't meant to be as big as show lines. They're meant to be faster, more energetic, more driven, more determined, more game, smaller, and more athletic. We want that because they're designed to work. That's why we have a small Labrador that's like a fucking pocket rocket because they are absolute nutters. So, what will be a good test for you, yeah. and you, and your dog's just super chill. 